Hopefully everybody is having a good day. You know, today's video is just going to be a video of, you know, two grown men or three grown men just really having a conversation, trying to enlighten another brother on, you know, the things that, you know, we need to change in our life, the things that needs to be changed in order to make our spouse happy, man. Forget about the negative fools out there who's going to be spewing a lot of bull crap. You know, people are always going to do that. It is what it is, man. You know, so hopefully you guys really enjoy this video here with us. Just having a heart-to-heart having a -heart -heart talk with David, man. Um, and at the end of the video, I'm going to put up a split-screen video showing you guys, you know, what another occupational therapy, you know, is doing with him, how hard he really has been working to get himself, you know, to assist his lovely wife whenever he gets home however soon or however later that is. But anyway, no more talking, just enjoy the video, man. So I'm here with Dennis, the good doctor, and David. We over here, we wanna have a conversation with David because, you know, we saw the video that Rose put up and we saw the video that David put up. Being the doctor came to the same conclusion that we need to come up here and we need to have a talk here with, with David. All right? Getting into that situation. Right. And while I must confess I am as guilty as the next person, as I've gotten older, it's become apparent to me that, that I've failed on a, many occasions in doing that. But let me tell you something what you're saying. One thing that I have learned from being here <laughs> is everybody is intelligent in their own... No question. No in their question. own field. Yeah. And sometimes you know, Rose doesn't listen to me. Oh, if, if I listen to Rose, maybe she'll start listening to what I'm saying a little bit more. Could it be the way you... Could it be the way you speak to her? Because sometimes, particularly when we get into these discussions with friends and yeah. family... I need some water. Hold on. Water. Water. Okay. Yeah. Sometimes when we get into discussions, arguments, disagreements, people find it very difficult to... To, to, to follow what you're saying because they're listening to the way you're saying it. And but they here's don't the problem. The exactly. 100%, and I've told people this before, mm -hmm. you have to excuse me. I've been a boss all my life. So I talk to people like a boss, even when I shouldn't, mm -hmm. when they're not my employees. So I, I have a bad habit of telling people what to do instead of asking them what no, to do. Good point. And, and that's just from being a boss for so many years. So, David, yeah. did you, you heard what your wife said on the video today, right? What did she say? Which one are you talking She said a lot of things on the video. Um, but did you hear anything that she, she said on the video? I heard all of it. So, are you going to at least, um, when she talks to you in that way, are you going to just list her and just let her talk? But what you don't understand, you're going to ask her, can you um, elaborate to me what you mean so I can... Um, I can respond back to you in the, in the right way? I always listen to my wife. Okay. And that's what gets me mad, these people who are saying that I am that I treat her bad. Don't worry about what the people say. Okay, the, the, the people who say that don't know what a good man is. They're probably out drinking. They're probably out whoring. And, and they don't live in my house or next to anybody. They don't know. But But the thing is that we're talking about is... Forget about those people. Yeah. We're talking about what you're going to be doing when you get back home w with your wife. Are, are you going to change? Are you going to change some ways? Are you going to hear the things? Some of the bad things that I've done, I'm going to stop smoking. I've got this lady here has been helping me. Show her. Been helping me stand up and knees over toes, right? Yeah, nose and over then, toes. Oh, nose over toes, yeah, not nose knees over toes. toes. I don't think this lovely occupational therapist <laughs> wants to be on YouTube. <laughs> are you Are you here for him? I am. Oh, okay. We oh. have some therapy scheduled. Um, I it's a weekly update. Which one are we doing today? Occupational therapy. Which one? Uh, take a shower. Yeah, because I smell like a <laughs> wet dog. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let All me right. go grab the towels and things. Okay, but you know what we're trying to talk to you about, David, is um, not worrying about what people yeah. have to say. They're always going to say things. You know what is more important is what you and your wife going to be working on to make things better for her and for you. That's the most important thing. 
not what other people are going to say because people are always going to say things yeah. and they're not going to stop no because you know what what I find is most of the world are losers but David I wish something I had said do you know what projection is mm -hmm. I project mm -hmm. I project and and when we when we find information difficult to, 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 to absorb or yes. difficult to take, we tend to use projection as a sword mm -hmm. to keep that off of us because we don't want guilt. There is no guilt. Uh, okay. I have not I've not done guilty things. I have done one if I've done anything, it's more hurting me being so insecure. Yeah. But I have I have nothing to be guilty of. Which is tonight. interesting but, because that's a bit that's a bit counterintuitive, yes. particularly since you always project that. You said something Power. else. Power. Rose is not going anywhere. Mm -hmm. Right. You she said, said that, that to you too on that video too. Your actions suggest yeah. that you are afraid that she is. I am very afraid if she is, because but, but you, you see, David, but you that's, hold, that's but, but that's what we're talking about. <laughs> How are you holding both of those <laughs> in the same? Hands. I don't understand how that how I'm doing that. That is a bad thing, but I have. But you're just not hurting yourself when you do that. Of course, I, that, I already know that. You're hurting her too. And I that, already know that. And David, that cognitive dissonance, holding those two opposites together, serves to not believe either well, one. Well, and it serves to damage uh, yeah, your relationship. So you have to find some way of dealing with that because okay, that well, cognitive dissonance will likely my problem cause is problem. I gotta quit thinking I gotta quit punishing Rose for what other people have done thank oh, you and the first exactly. question that the good docs just asked you just now is David Who's are you going, going to be going home? home as the same David when you yeah. left or are you gonna go back home as a different David Rose <laughs> want a nicer different kinder I am David. nicer and kinder. <laughs> and I'm already nicer and kinder. Don't project, though, my friend. I'm not trying to project. I'm, I'm saying that just as, as quiet. I am a nice husband. I don't cheat on my wife. And we believe that. There's I, no doubt. I don't drink. I'm not doing drugs. I don't hit her. But don't send a message, though, that you don't believe in her and you don't believe what she's saying that she's not doing. Believe, believe it or not, I believe Rose is not doing anything. Do you Good. make that clear to her? No. But you have but to. David? I know God. it's a mistake of mine. I know yeah, it's a mistake David, of mine. That's a mistake. All David, right. you made it very clear to everyone. When you met that woman, you had absolutely, absolutely nothing. nothing. So how could her attachment be anything other than Me. genuine and real and the essence of what we're all hoping to find. That's okay. what we all think we have. So I mean, here's like, the problem. Um, do you got to understand. No, no, just no, you just need stay to wait. Okay. You, you know, no, go ahead and take care of him. No, That's just fine. wait because I want him to take a video and so Rose will see I can stand. Do you have time? Him. I know you have a lot of other patients today. Yeah, I have an hour and a half with him, so we can stand. Okay, oh. and okay. Um, yeah. I'm... I'm just... Thank, thank you, my friend, my fellow occupational therapist. Oh, are you too? <laughs> oh, beautiful. I forget what I was saying. I'm... The problem is, it's just like with her. She'll tell you that a lot of times when I can't do something, it's because I'm afraid, right? Yeah. yeah. I'm afraid I'm going to fall or I'm afraid that I'm, I'm not doing it right. But you have to believe in what people who are here to help you tell you. You have to believe in them. I believe in rules. One hundred percent I believe in rules. But then some things sometimes she does things to make me not believe in her. And and that's the problem. But David, we're all not perfect. We all here married men. Right. Every last one of us. And we're all three married to Filipinas. Yes. Okay. Okay. And I'm the shortest time married to Filipinos. How long have you been married to your wife? I've been with my wife now going in eight years. Okay, eight years. So he's got me by two years. You've been with yours, what, 35? <laughs> so, you know, we all have those doubts, but we don't want to portray them onto our wives to make them think otherwise. We can't do that, my friend. Okay, it's not, I know that's not good. Can't do that. 
These are friends here talking to you, I not did, people no, who are leaving I, bad I comments on your I videos. Was to. I was to this. this is called a gate belt, um, and it's, it provides you a handle for holding on to him um, safely. If he starts to lose his balance, you're holding on to this, you're going to keep him from hitting the floor. So I'm going to show you how to put it on safely. I'm going to have you lean forward, David. We want to go low on the hips. And then I put my hands over it. Yep. Uh, and the the belt, the alligator eats it and then poops it out. <laughs> <laughs> and you want it nice and tight, Rose. Nice and tight. Otherwise, it's not going to do you any good. And okay. on this on this uh, on this wheelchair, the sides come off. So if if it's a, a bad day where I don't have a lot of power, I can just hop. Over onto the yeah, bed. Yeah, right? yep, that would make it a lot easier. Yep. Or we can. A little closer. Or I'll knock the heel. Or we could do it like I prefer to do it. I like to stand up and then go down. Okay, can you lock that wheel? Is it locked? Nope. Yeah. Perfect. I don't think it's locked. Yes. Okay. Oh, you're right. It bounced back. There we go. All right. Okay. One. Sit nose over toes. Perfect. One, two, three. I couldn't do that when I left. Nicely done. Beautiful. So, Rose, I only gave him a little bit of help um, lifting up. He's still working on the strength in his legs. Mm -hmm. I only gave him a little bit of help, but you should be able to do it. No problem. You want to go I'm going just a little bit because I. You're tired. Because I'm tired. No, I, this is the third, third therapy of the day. Yeah. Okay, now we're going to show you how to do it. Then I can do it. Just Getting into the wheelchair. Chair, yeah. Okay. Now I'm going to get in. Let me grab this. Okay, you ready? Yeah. No, you're in the wrong spot. I need you on the other side. One. Two, two, three. Nose over toes. Okay. Good. And they stupid. Okay, come on, slide, slide. My foot slide. And this belt is nowhere near tight enough. It's oh, okay. Feels like it's falling. I got him. Okay. Okay, take a step towards me. Right. Okay. Good. Excellent. Much better than before, David. Okay. All right. Here, take this one. Is that all you needed? Okay. I got this. I can't pull off. Good job, David. It's great, man. All right. And of this course. Is how he'll do it on a like on a bad day. So again, on a bad day when there's nobody to help me, or I'm just feeling really weak in my legs, I can just bounce over onto the bed. Is your foot there blocking my foot because it's sliding? No, sliding this way. This way? Yeah. Okay, see? And then. Position yourself, away. position yourself well before you do that, David. Okay, all right. Well, okay, what is it? Off before you lay down. I need to get the belt. Off before you lay down. And back. And one little bit. And then hook my leg and then. There you have it. That's it. Perfect. Woo! That's it. Good job. There.